Hey, what's up, everybody? Lionheart here, and today I decided I wanted to learn how to play the white tip. This is one of the last sharks that I haven't given too much love, so I figured it was definitely time. It took a couple matches to really get into the groove, but I feel like I have a good understanding of it now, so you can expect to see this tutorial pretty soon, and I hope you enjoy my, uh, my learning experience. Probably the perfect map right here when learning how to play a shark. It's going to put you in all kinds of different um, situations. Small rooms, big rooms, dark rooms, light rooms, smoke and water, etc. You know, if you go play on a shark favored map, it's probably going to be a little bit too easy and then you're not going to learn the things that you need to learn. So Antugo is a good place to start. I did see that one guy had a mine stuck on the back of him, so I warned my partner. Not sure where he's going to place that. And we're just going to go in through the top like always. I'm sure you guys expected this. Looks like one guy might be paying attention to us, so we're not going to go in immediately. All right, yeah, he's taking a couple shots. Partner is in position. So let's go ahead and head in here. And we're going to miss. We're going to miss. Okay, we've got our diver. All right, he scrapped that one. And I missed this guy. Partner's dead now, but we should still be able to grab one more or not. Uh, still learning where to aim with the white tip. It's going to take a couple of tries, obviously. Sometimes you aim at the top of the dorsal fin. Sometimes it's the bottom of the dorsal fin. Sometimes it's like right in the, uh, the center of the mouth. He charged a little bit different. Yeah. Missed again. No. Again, it's going to take a couple of tries. Please bear with me. Partner's patiently waiting, so we're going to heal up real quick before we head back in there. But we are going to go through a different entrance. You couldn't have waited just a couple of seconds. Just, just a few seconds. I was on my way. Let's just wait. Uh, we're going to... Here we go. This is exactly what I wanted. All right, he moved back. No big deal. No big deal. I was waiting for someone to get right in front of that entrance so I'd have a nice easy in and out. I'm just going to prep this wall. Uh, we will use it later, and also hopefully it'll put some attention to that side of the room we do need to get some kills here one head back in we'll get two uh there's only one guy left there's a buoy here so i need him to get a little bit closer there we go and did we get the buoy too no we did not but respawns were shooting at us so we had to leave we should be able to get this guy right here though nice, nice. little uh Hit on Steve there to slow it down. We'll go back in. Uh, APS rifle already. Um, oh, oh yeah, Steve left. Okay. I was like, man, was someone getting gold? No, no, Steve already cashed out that first save point. So yeah, they have plenty of gold. Uh, not used to seeing an APS rifle so quick though. Normally they uh, double down on their pistols. We get two. Oh, we got two. Uh, normally they double down on their pistols, start getting some attachments uh, or modifiers rather, and some equipment. But Looks like one guy placed one buoy. It might have been a buoy that I saw earlier. Because I haven't heard that mine explode. Partner's being very aggressive. He's going in by himself. I know I do that a lot too, so I'm not going to complain about it. Just going to heal the full while we wait for him to respawn. Oh, oh, can we get this guy? No, he went back in already. Uh, unfortunately, they have plenty of gold. We weren't very aggressive early on. Okay, so one was paying attention there. That's, uh, that's why I generally always prep it and then I use it later. I, ne I never go in through the wall. It's too easy to just pre-fire. We missed him. We're getting out. I, sec I, I second guessed what I wanted to do. My original intention was to jump in through this through the top, grab that diver, and then head through the wall that I had prepped earlier. I missed him. I should have kept going because that was my original intention. But I saw that diver. I didn't know if he saw me. I kind of wanted to go for him. Whenever you, um... Oh, I this guy. Is there anybody? No, no. I shot it. Uh, whenever... Or I feel like whenever you second guess yourself, it gives the divers too much time to react. So you have to know what you're going to do. Alright. Should be good here. Okay. Alright. Just, uh my fault right there I, I underestimated exactly how far away i was the visibility etc i mean it was a good shot from him though he definitely could just barely see my tail i would assume 
I can part this just in there by himself. I really wish he would wait just a couple seconds. But again, here I, I'm, I'm in here by myself right now. But I, I know that I can get one kill and then I thought that I was going to be able to heal up there. They're just the right amount of aggressive. They're, they're not chasing me down, but they will keep the exit that I went through. So I, I've got to keep that in mind. Obviously, if I have enough health, I will always turn around and wait for that peak. But when I'm pretty low, I have a bad habit of just going straight for health. Like, here we go. See? Look, I hid. I was getting shot. I had I went straight for health up into the open water. Probably would have gotten me there. That mine actually saved us. It disoriented him just enough where he couldn't uh, accurately shoot at me. But I did miss my target. I should have died there. Just going to heal back up. Uh, looking at the scoreboard and I'm not real happy right now. Sorry, new to this shark. Hey, hey no problem, buddy. We're all new. Like, I'm new to this shark myself. So, you know, learning experiences. No, no, don't get stuck. No. Didn't I do this a couple days ago? I, I, I think it was with the Great White. I tried to go through that window and Steve decided it was not my time. Open water. This is where I like to think that I'm decent, but apparently not. Come on, grab him, please. Thank you, thank you, thank you. My partner was able to grab one before he died. We should be able to get this guy right here. He's being very aggressive. Or we can keep missing at his partner. I'm dead. All right, yeah, this guy will not give up on me. And my teammate ignored him. All right, we got you here. Nope. Can I please miss? He did not miss. Remember earlier where I was talking about, you know, it takes a little bit to figure out your aim. That's the excuse I'm going to continue to go with, and I hope that you guys respect that. <laughs> Plenty of stamina here, thanks to Hangry. We're just going to zip around the room and see what we can do. I uh, believe I got hit with a spear gun there at the end. I was full health, and then I had none. Same thing, we have Hangry. We're just going to go and be very aggressive, zip around the room bleeding but it's not doing too too much we get one more oh no ads took care of us pretty quickly i know that the white tip can benefit from double time but this is the reason why i choose hangry on this shark right here just being able to have it, it it's so great for uh anyone that used power kill number three no no Again, with the second guessing, I sat still. Should I go for the guy in the corner? Should I go back to the guy outside? Give that guy plenty of time to react to me. Take me out. Same thing, just going to be very aggressive. Zip around the room. Unfortunately, bleeding is not letting us have as much fun as we'd like to have. But we did get some kills there. Uh, we were a distraction. We allowed our partner to get in there as well and get a killer to our uh, just one of them. They're about to be back in open water. They have plenty of lives, but it is a decently long trip. We should be able to finish them off as long as we play it slow. I have every evolution that I need. A couple of heals. Luckily, he missed the shot. Partner grabbed him, and I'll grab this guy, keep him from getting you. You. And he had a nice little cheeky hit on Steve there. Not sure if he meant to do that or if he missed the diver, but it, you know, it's good. It keeps them out in the open a little bit longer. He's going for the shark shield. Nice, nice. And this guy knows what he's doing. He's just new to the shark. Like said. On a rampage. That's just a start. I know, like, I'm feeling comfortable with the white tip now. And like I said, I have every, every uh, evolution that I need. There's PAT right there. We're going to make sure we take out that PAT. Gonna sneak up on this diver, he's not even gonna know what hit him. Alright, and yes, we got the PAT as well. He had it on follow mode, it looked like it was moving towards him. Should be able to get an easy kill right here. Number six. I am unstoppable. Thank you for uh, noticing. Take us left. Mm. Ooh. I, one guy left. I don't think they're going to win it. 
He was kind of bad. Oh, he's headed for the um for the diver cage. All right, well you can't shoot me, so I'm just gonna hit Steve until you either come here or Steve dies. Oh, looks like my partner got him. GG's. Uh, not a bad game by all means. I mean, 26 kills is great, but it was an ugly 26 kills. I will be the first one to admit that. You guys don't have to tell me. I'm well aware. Should be an interesting match right here. On Stash, I always use either the Hammerhead or the Great White. I don't think I've... Well, obviously, I've used the Tiger on it. <laughs> you, guys, you know, obviously, I love the Tiger. It's my favorite shark. I use it on every map that I can. But... I feel like this is a really good map for um, tanks. But speed sharks, obviously, you can use them anywhere. I've said obviously about four times in the past minute, so I, I will try to stop. I did see one guy getting gold, with, or he had, had the DPV. He's going for gold. He's right here. We're not going to let that happen. No gold for you. Okay. There was one more guy outside. I don't know if he's still out here. I don't see him. We're just gonna destroy okay oh that's right uh, i forgot again uh, i'm used to playing a hammerhead or a great white on this map and they take out these gates with one hit it might prove troublesome come on can we get up? no 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 i went inside i went inside <laughs> i'm dead at least we got that kill but we should not be dead right now we should still be causing havoc as i was saying though i'm really used to being able to just go through these gates with one hit so that's probably gonna cause me some troubles later Hopefully not, though. Right. He didn't go back over there to get gold. I noticed one diver was missing, but he's just he's still dead. This guy down here grabbing gold. Oh, this is the guy with the DPP. Do you have a DPV and you're staying inside the first save? Really? Oh, I just finished this guy off. No, no. We did uh, do a little bit of damage to him, but he did get us. Um... Does he think about that guy with the DPV? I've never seen that before. You have a DPV and you're just hanging around the first safe area. Go get gold, my dude. Waiting for the partner to get a little bit closer before we head back in. Uh, unfortunately, not able to get him, but we did provide a distraction for our partner to get one kill. Unfortunately, that was uh, not as good as we would have liked it. Like for it to have been. Should be able to get quite a few kills here, though. If I'm not going to, though, because I decided I wanted to aim very low. I think this is going to be another one of those ugly games, but hopefully we'll still pull out the victory. As long as we're hoping for things, let's hope that uh, I actually start playing, playing well. Nice dodge. I'll give you credit for that one, sir. Always definitely paying attention. And uh, again, with the, uh, back to the gates. I'm used to just being able to grab a diver and bust right through them to safety. Just sitting all stuck. Luckily, this door was nice and prepped. Ooh. Give me two easy kills. I, I do something like this, and I guarantee you, my next the next thing I'm gonna do is just screw up. Uh, Ask and ye shall receive, right? I don't have powerful tell yet, but we don't really need it until we get to that third save. So I have been uh, leveling up my special ability a little bit more. Give me a bit more protection and a bit more damage with these smaller rooms. Uh, I have to actually hit my target for that to actually matter. Hello? Really? I just lunged at you, and instead of running, trying to lose me, you're gonna continue to pick up gold. You don't hear your heartbeat. I'm right next to you, sir. Just gonna damage this guy a little. Okay, or we can get the whole kill before we die. Uh, I wanted to just damage him a little bit and respawn because I knew I had enough powerful tail. But I'll take that kill. Definitely need powerful tail here because they are about to be in open water, and this next safe room is a nice big safe room. There's plenty of area first to move around and it, powerful tells 100 percent necessary i believe just gonna wait for them to come outside there we go steve's on the move there was no point in just diving in there and losing our life better in the open water anyway 
Got a nice little cheeky hit on Steve by accident, but I will always take that. And I will also give you credit for that spear shot, sir. You prevented a quad or quite possibly a penta from happening in my opinion. Like, only three of them are inside. I don't know where the other guy is, but we're just gonna go in and out here. Someone just placed something. Probably a mine, I don't hear a buoy. We're gonna go back in and we're gonna go back out. Partner's heading in, so we're just gonna go right back in. Yeah, okay, it was a mine. There's a quad. Nice, plenty of health. Come on, give me the penta. Give me the penta. Oh, no, no, no. Don't miss. All right, I got you this time. Oh, I was too thirsty. I was too hungry. I wanted that kill. I wanted a penta. I gotta look good on camera. But I suppose a triple followed by a quad's not that bad. I also heard another mine being placed and another one just being placed. Keep booze in there. Mine's in there. Right, it seems like they placed them all right next to each other. That definitely was a chain reaction. But we got a kill or two, and I don't think Steve took any damage, but there should be some weak divers in there for us. We have our heal now, so we should be able to just go on a nice rampage here. Here's the first one. Let our heal give us back our health before we head back in. Number two. Just keep moving. Here's number three. Oh, he turned around. If he didn't turn around, he was definitely knocked. So that's a triple or quad or triple. Okay, yeah, yeah. Not doing too bad. We'll just grab serrated teeth so that we can finish off these last four divers. I hear a PT in there. Missed. We've got this guy. We'll head. But we were about to aim for that PAT, and it looks like we would have picked up a diver going for a, uh, a supply. It looks like a supply kit. But the guy with the spear gun again. Stand still for half a second and he's gonna take you out. Just two left. And now we'll go back in and we'll grab this last guy right now. And that would be game. One hit on Steve, just for the points. Yeah, there we go. 25. A bit better performance still. Uh, not that great. The early game, I think I need to work on a bit more. But, you know, once I get my talents, or my evolutions rather, I feel like I've got a pretty decent control. Well, I hope you guys had a couple of good laughs. I hope maybe you learned something. But I wanted to try out this format where I show you guys me learning a new shark as opposed to just uh, playing ones that I'm already very familiar with and showing you like some of my best matches. I wanted to show you guys that there are things that I'm also not that great at, although you probably don't think I'm great anyways. But hopefully I at least entertain. Uh, in any case, if you've enjoyed the video, please drop a like leave a comment, and don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in game.